right, guys, I am starting my Crock-Pot Fiesta Chicken, and I'm just using two frozen chicken breasts because I didn't have any thawed, and I don't want to use more than two. These are huge breasts, so this is four to five meals for us, probably more like five, and we don't want too much leftovers. We don't want too many leftovers, so we're just going to use two chicken breasts and call it good, and I am going to add the rest of the stuff here. I have this on low right now. Okay, it doesn't call for actual onions, but I am going to add that as our ingredient because we love a lot of onions in our stuff. Hey guys, what I'm doing right now is mixing all of the stuff in my jar here, and I need 16 ounces of salsa. I'm using the paste because it is zero smart points. So turn it on ounces here, and I'm going to put in 16 ounces There we go. And I got maybe a cup left in there. And now I put, I didn't have any black beans. I thought I did, but apparently I did not. It says to mix this all up in your container. I have the spices I have, and I just used, instead of a bunch of different spices, I just used a taco seasoning. So that's what I did. And I used a can of red beans instead of black beans hopefully that won't make too much of a difference and then it just says to stir this all up and i used a bag of sweet corn the flavor pack just regular frozen sweet corn i used the whole bag of that because it is four servings and that's what i intend to make out of this dish is four servings so that's what we did And now it says to just dump this over your mixture. And I have the just the chicken, frozen chicken, two of them, and then one onion diced up. And I'm just going to pour this over the top. Spread this all out. And because I have a little bit extra broth that I have not used, I'm just going to dump maybe a quarter cup in there just so it's got some liquid at the bottom. And then I'm going to slap my cover on this. I just didn't want the broth going to waste. You definitely don't have to add the broth, but I thought, why, why waste it? And that is it for the first part of this cook with me, guys. And with these kind of tops, when you have these special little lids on them, while your stuff is cooking, do not lock this like that. Don't lock it because you could have some problems going on if you do. So I just leave them both up. You don't need to lock it. It'll stay closed good and tight. But it definitely says in the directions it's dangerous to lock those closed. So definitely, I see a lot of people locking theirs closed. So definitely don't do that. It might, I don't know what could happen, but it could be bad, guys. Otherwise, they wouldn't say not to do it, right? So that's the first part of the cook with me. I have this on low. I'm gonna leave it go for several hours and we'll come back and take a look at it in a few hours. All right, guys, this is dinner tonight. I've got the chicken shredded up. It shredded so easily. All I really had to do is stir it and it shredded right up. It looks delicious. I think three breasts would have been way too much. So this looks perfect. This is two breasts and it's gonna be five or six servings worth of dinners so it looks delicious and I'm going to show you what I'm gonna do next here all right guys we have the one-third fat one-third less fat Philadelphia cream cheese and I got it opened and I'm just going to plop this right on top just like that and I'm going to close up the lid and leave it cook for another 15 to 20 minutes and I am going to start my brown rice right now. All right guys, what I got here is two and a half cups of water and one cup of the organic sprouted brown rice. And that's what we're gonna be eating our chicken over. I'll give you the points of all this after I figure it all out at the end of the video. I'm gonna bring this to a boil and then when it comes to a boil, I'm gonna turn it down on low and cover it with a tight cover. And then it's going to cook for about 45 to 50 minutes. 
Guys, this is the crock pot pasta chicken and it is so good. I'm having this over rice and I'm just having a little sample of this. So I'm gonna try this out, let you know how it is. And 